In part 1 we have designed a monopole antenna. Now we are going to check the result and we will add parametric sweep in the length of monopole antenna and the radius of monopole antenna. And we will see the effect of varying the length of monopole antenna and the radius of monopole antenna on the bandwidth gain return loss and everything we will discuss in this lecture if you want to design this monopole antenna you can check the part 1 now I am going to add a parametric sweep add this parametric sweep to the ML ML is a monopole length parameter which I have added this much with the step size of this and you can see that it will find the length for different length of monopole antenna for this monopole antenna at 5 millimeter up to 120 millimeter in actual design the monopole antenna length was 72 millimeter after adding this you just add these values and update after that press ok and and after that press ok the sweep will be added after analyzing this project we will get these result first of all I am going to check for return loss plot for different length of this monopole antenna here you can see that this is the actual plot of our monopole antenna which is operating frequency is 0.9 gigahertz if you will increase the length the frequency will be reduced in next parameterized result which is at 75 now you can see that this has been reduced frequency has been reduced now this next sweep is at 85 millimeter similarly at this which is at 95 millimeter is the length of monopole the frequency has been reduced to 0.75 gigahertz and similarly if we decrease the length of this monopole antenna the frequency will increase here you can see that this is for 55 millimeter length of monopole antenna the concept of increasing and decreasing of this the monopole antenna is straight forward you can you have observed this from this parameterized sweep and similarly it also affect other parameters now check the effect of changing the mo monopole length on a smith chart for impedance plot Here you can see that at a higher values of greater length of this monopole antenna, this is going to shift toward this off. Here you can this see that the, this is the maximum value which is 120 millimeter of this monopole whose graph is this. But at minimum values the graph is shifting downward as a capacitive here you can see that the capacitive and inductive behavior is also change little bit by changing the length of monopole antenna if I change this parametric sweep into this sweep Now you can see that 
and update this and press ok and ok this and analyze after analyzing this you will observe this result here you can see that the best result I have got for monopole length is at 55 millimeter similarly with increasing further the matching is not quite good This is we have a polar plot for this design. This is we have the behavior at 55 millimeter monopole length. It is passing nearly from a center of this polar plot which is quite good behavior in this case we are using a finite ground plane but in finite ground plane the directivity of monopole antenna is doubled as compared to dipole antenna because the radiations are an upper surface of a ground plane in next part we will see the effect of varying the radius of monopole antenna on the parameters of the antenna.